Okay, we're all good to finish up this whole little area. Hopefully. Oh my god! Well, that packed up. They lived? What? I'd be lying if I didn't say I was disappointed that he survived the shot. A man got hit by an RPG and they're like, I'll get up. Right, I never found this last damn tube. Where the hell is it? <laughs> I found quite a few people. Are you holding out on me for the tube? If you're consulted, then what you see, I get it. So I did such a and I had a group of talk about bad exception. They may already be something like that. Find them. All right, call them. Thank you. How many have I found? There was the guy up there. I think I'm missing a guy then. Because there was a chick by the staircase, the chick in the med bay, the guy who was up top. Yeah, because I can't talk to her anymore. wasn't a guy down here was there that I just missed because I died and restarted it or got stuck sorry I shouldn't have to go too much further in here to find that out though
Alright, so this was absolutely not worth the visit back down here. My bad. Gotta be at the door a little bit. I am so tempted to look it up because it's gonna bother me. And I know it is. But I won't. Get back. Give Claire her head back and then we'll... Installing the head. All her body parts assembled. What now? Self-repair procedure complete. I am ready for service. Thank you, comrade. We will now initiate the launch sequence. First launch code sequence generated. Please confirm that launch code sequence is matched. Second launch code sequence generated. Launch code sequence is matched. Initiating BDNH mode of operational change. New mode, military drill. Whew, I think we made it. Thanks, ladies. Thank you, dear comrade. Please, comrade Molotov, I beg you. It's not safe here. So it's still dangerous. I was told everything was under control. There was a minor issue, but Major Nichaev, uh, forgive me, Agent P3 has already dealt with it. What exactly did he deal with? There's blood all over the place. That's not blood. It's paint. Comrade Sechenov. You're playing a dangerous game here. Greetings, Comrade Molotov. I don't follow you. What game? You know what I'm talking about, Comrade Sechenov. Your local malfunction is actually a worldwide catastrophe. Your robots in combat mode. Countless human casualties. Need I go on? Oh, please do. But first I'd like to know how you obtained this information. From Viktor Vasilievich Petrov, your engineer, an outstanding roboticist, an honored citizen of the Soviet Union. That's what he used to be. Now he's prisoner number 230385. Sentenced to community service at the Vavilov complex. By your order, you are in direct violation of Soviet law. As a minister, the minister of industry, you know the consequences. Here is the procurator general's decree. The upcoming launch of the collective neural network will be canceled, and you'll be the subject of a full-fledged investigation. Am I making myself clear, Comrade Sechenov? Comrade Molotov, may I have a word with you in private? <laughs> Do you really think that's going to change anything? <laughs> Fine. I'll meet you here in 15 minutes. Mikhail, meet me at the landing pad. Right away, sir. I I'm sorry, sir. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> Aren't you in a hurry to see your master, Major? Stockhausen seems awfully eager. Is something wrong, Major? Major, I asked you a question. Lock the door. What's going on? I said lock the door.
I have concerns. the hell? Oh no, I'm a furry. My instinctive need to gather all the things. Am I stuck? Oh my god. If I didn't know any better, I'd say my guy had PTSD. Wake me up. I want to scream. I can't wait to grab all these and be like, oh, you died because you did so. Like, oh my god. I have one goal right now, and it is this damn apple. No! Collect the damn it! Oh. Why did you stop advancing the plot for an hour? Because I couldn't get the damn apple. Yeah! Alright, moving on. Can cats even eat apples? Now I'm just convinced the man died, because this, this is hell. I can't get the damn apples.
Hmm? Every apple collected there? Good. None missed still? Alright. Not without my last apple, I won't. Yeah, I didn't need the apples at all. Got it. <laughs> Just a menace. <laughs> I waste so much time hunting those you apples. Alive. You're alive. Uh, I guess so, yeah. Comrade Sechenov. The government commission. They're dead. Molotov's body is here. What about the others? How many people were with him? F Fifteen or so. Some of them may have survived. Find out. Uh, what the fuck happened here? Who the fuck did this? Guess the robots got in. You were fortunate to escape unharmed. C Comrade Sechenov, all the members of the Commission are dead. All of them. This is tragic, but it changes nothing. Collective must still be activated. I couldn't agree more. But what should we do with the dead Politburo member? We don't have a lot of options here. Right? Handle it. Mikhail, head to the radio station and make sure power to the government line has been cut. Make it quick. Uh, yes, sir, but the Kremlin will be expecting a report from Comrade Molotov. I will personally inform the Politburo of this tragedy. Hurry, Mikhail. We don't have much time. Left. Help her. Me, I, I'm the problem. Not good. I failed you again. This is too much. It's too much for all of us. This terrible incident. You don't seem too broken up about it. Not the belly button. Now I'm just confused. Respectfully, the hell is that?
What? What was that? A tribute to the departed. Comrade Sechenov! We've got a problem. The central hub is broadcasting. Someone is trying to send information to the West. Who? Who could have done that? There are only two people who could have done it. You and Petrov. Petrov's dead. I saw his body. Just his body. Petrov is first and foremost a head. It was his body. How's that possible? Filatov. Hmm. When your accomplice is a neurosurgeon of Dr. Filatova's caliber, then anything is possible. Have you traced the signature? Petrov is masking his signature, but I'm sure he's in one of the scientific centers. Did you hear that, my boy? Go find him. Right now. Would I kindly go find them? Damn. <laughs> that was Charles. a lot. What the hell happened down there? What exactly are you asking about? Who killed the government commission? How did I survive? Sorry, I cannot help you. You suddenly lost consciousness as though you'd been struck from behind. When that happened, I was also disabled. What was that monster made of red polymer? That was a neuropolymer data storage. A data storage? What does it store? Dead bodies? The boss said it was a tribute to the departed. What's that got to do with data? You will have to ask Dr. Sechenov himself. For my part, all I can say is that Professor Zaharov died the exact same way. This is fucking nuts. I really thought the polymer was harmless. <sighs> Fair enough. Find Petrov and return to Chelome as soon as possible. This will be the best outcome for everyone. Charles, why did that monster, you know, the red polymer thing, the, the data storage, why did it look like a person? Dr. Sechenov's idea. He wanted it to move independently. Why would a data storage need to walk around? So it could run off someplace and get lost along with all its important information? It won't run off. It's as loyal to Dr. Sechenov as the ballerina twins. When Dr. Sechenov releases it into the outside world, it always remains near him as an additional security measure. Security? So it can attack people? What do you think, Comrade Major? Why would a neuropolymer substance capable of dissolving a human being in mere seconds need to be able to move independently? Shit on a shingle. You're telling me that Jelly Man can sneak up behind someone and kill them instantly, without leaving a trace? It does remind me of a certain person who died under mysterious circumstances, and without witnesses, after slipping and falling into a bath. Crispy critters. Yeah, makes you think. Well. What's that? Oh, and open spaces, what? <laughs> That's reassuring. What's over here? So, Charles, when Dr. Sechenov sends his twins somewhere on an assignment with, say, Stockhausen, he's guarded by that red monster? Makes sense. Comrade Stockhausen is incapable of independently reaching his destination within a facility swarming with hostile robots, and Sechenov would never remain unguarded. Why? 
He's a hero of the Soviet Union. Everybody loves the guy. Why would anybody want to hurt him? Why indeed, Comrade Major? You think there are people in the Kremlin who are jealous of him and want to get rid of him? It's more likely that they just want power over Collective. If you rule the cool, huh? world, it's hardly surprising if people want to take your throne. Very powerful people. I'd rather have Dr. Sechenov be the General Secretary of Collective than anybody else. The General Secretary? Is that what you think he's going to be? Of course. What else would he be? I hope you're right. Sorry, buddy. Same old shit. This way now. Charles, how could that prick Petrov send intel to the West? The facility's under lockdown. Petrov cannot transfer. Major, there will soon be so many enemies here that your demise is inevitable. Just hides up in the woods, it's fine. Charles, is there really a chance Petrov could fool the hub? It wasn't exactly programmed by morons, right? They must have put protections in place. Petrov is a talented engineer and programmer. There's a reason he made it to Facility 3826. He's the one who optimized the programmer-to-robot and robot-to-robot -robot digital data transfer protocols. So he knows better than anyone how the central hub works. Does that mean Petrov could actually fool the hub? Then why did Dr. Sechenov trust these protocols to a single guy? It's temporary. After the launch of Collective 2.0, digital communication channels will be rendered useless and irrelevant. Everything will be transmitted via neuropolymer wave emission. Binary code will be left in the dustbin of history. And so will programmers. No wonder Petrov is so pissed. He wants to fuck shit up while he still can. In broad strokes, although I suspect that Petrov has other motives. He's a traitor to the motherland. Fuck his motives. How long do we have to stop him? Hacking Collective Central Hub is a very difficult task. Even with the right communication equipment, Petrov will need considerable time to do it. So where can he find that kind of equipment? Other than the Science Center? Only aboard the Flying Chelemay Complex. And nowhere else? <laughs> That's great. Your goose is cooked now, Petrov, you traitorous dickhead. Okay. Access granted. No car that play though, huh?
The random hollow room explosion? Oh, the chest. Two chests in there. Zoop. Fish. Hey, Charles, what does the Sechenov Center study? Radio waves, Comrade Major. It contains equipment that will help Petrov detect you. So move with caution. Guess we better stay quiet then. Uh-huh. Super stealthy. Hey, I'm a tree. I am a tree. Shh. I am a tree. I'm trying to be a tree, damn it. Y'all need to chill. The audacity of some people. I'm just out here trying to live my best tree life. And they're just like... Ah, uh, you can't do that. You need to choose violence. Pop! Oh, I missed. Hell place to park. Major Nichayev, codename P3, access granted. Oh yeah, cause I can just throw stuff into my storage from here, right? Yeah. Okay. Nice and simple and stealthy. No one will notice me. Creepy. I wonder if this adventure would have gone quick with a car.
Whatever. Nobody had to know. Seems like a lot of problems outside. Just a quick exit if I need it. And this is why we opened them ahead of time. Cause that would have been bad. Because that would have been bad at random. So much to open in here. For useless stuff I'm probably not gonna use anytime soon. message huh. it appears I took the wrong door Another secret message. Audio files. He is here. Okay.
Take your time now. Don't rush it. What are we rushing? Just a little more. No, not ready yet, my dear. Intriguing, isn't it? Well, we'll just wait a little longer. The microwave is ready. You're fired. Fuck you and the horse you rode in on, Pest Stop. You've been tracking radio waves from space for three years and waiting for aliens? That was a goddamn microwave oven. I hope you get killed by a meteorite, you fucking asshole. I've had it up to here with you. Petrov is somewhere nearby, Comrade Major. Keep it down. Well, I don't have the damn cookie, but... Started. All right, easy enough. Anything good in here? Next. Oh good, all the loot was still on the bottom half of the body. Nothing else. I see every step you take, mutt! You'll never stop me! Gods may do what cattle may not! Take the cookie. Good. Good. Look what we have here. He's unconscious, okay? Damn. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is noble in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against deceit and troubles, and by opposing in them. You know, it's, it's all wrong, it's all wrong. I don't agree. I'm sorry, Larissa, but I don't understand. He ruined everything, and you, you! I'm a doctor. Enough people have died today. People, Larissa! He's an animal! 
He'll rip anybody's throat out of Sechenov orders him to. Victor, he's tied up. I'll program a treatment and then we'll go. Go where? No one's coming for us. And this fucking lunatic's ruined our escape plan. I know. We'll come up with something. I doubt it. <laughs> Just let me go, and I promise I'll make it quick. <laughs> And painless. So Sechenov's talk and talk, huh? Look, he just came to and he's already threatening us. <laughs> yeah, I am threatening you. How many people have your robots slaughtered without so much as a warning? Petrov? Two thousand? Three thousand? That's not Victor's fault. Huh. It was a local malfunction. A local malfunction? Then why the shit doesn't your boyfriend have a scratch on him, huh? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? Isn't it obvious? First Vavilov, then the VDNH. The robots are attacking everyone except you two. Why is that if you're not controlling them? <laughs> Victor, you said you had nothing to do with this. <laughs> and you believed him. What other bullshit has this guy told you? <laughs> oh, man. Victor. I had no choice. A simple malfunction wouldn't have changed anything. How could you? Huh? How could I? You said it yourself, the whole world might end. No, don't touch me. <laughs> you really didn't tell her anything, did you? <laughs> A big mistake. Hey, what the hell? Hey, Larissa, wait! Larissa! Nothing can save you now, asshole. A little spider. Helpful. Fifty one. P three to Chelome. Petrov got away. Again. You seem to enjoy chasing the man, Nachayev. Petrov must not interfere with the launch of collective. Find the criminal. Now. You have drawn the wizard's ire, Comrade Major. No shit. Get off my grill, will ya? Damn, the game's like falling apart after that cutscene. Oh! Uh, yep, that's not good.
Guess we hurry after him. Expect to hear from me? Not only can I hear you just fine, I'm gonna see you real soon, too. So get ready, prick. Trust me, the preparations are well underway. There will be surprises, dog. You turned Louisa against me, bitch. She doesn't return my calls. Yeah, you're breaking my heart. I don't give two wet farts about your relationship. Charles, can you trace the call? Where is that shit stain? The signal's coming from the Plisetskaya Theater. A theater? Right here in the facility? <laughs> what a clown. It's a theater, Comrade Major, not a circus. Marking the waypoint. Whatever. I won't let that traitor get away from me again. Okay. No map for me. All right. We can have to deal with real quick, and let's see if we can make it there. Good time. Should make it even easier, a car. Another dead village. Yeah, logical. The facility complexes, especially Pavlov, obtain certain resources from here. The automatic sorting hub is used to provide the nearby factory with birds and animals. We're creating neuropolymers. Science is a real zero-sum game for game. What a clever pun. I'm impressed. Yeah, whatever. Wow, I couldn't even go through. All right, well, that's on me. It was a pleasure serving with you, Major P3. Unfortunately, you are about to be killed. No faith. Upgrade. Yeah, we'll just try to increase the damage of that. anything further on this. Reduce recoil, but I can't afford it. Aiming speed better. Still don't have that. That is what I will call it for today. We can figure out what happens next time I play this.